guys it's been a pretty long day today and i didn't vlog this morning and then i had a visitor uh, i had my nephew here for a couple of hours uh, basically i went up i woke up it took me a while i did a couple of stitches to wake up then i went uh, and did my training uh, which was pretty it been a long day um, it was a little bit hard training today but it's okay it's okay it can be hard sometimes but I did it um, and I got back in time to go um, getting some groceries before I picked up my nephew and then he was here uh, gaming and talking and being social um, and I've been beat all day the eye exam yesterday kind of made my migraine seven times worse than it had been for a while i've been having my headaches and a little bit of nausea but just a little bit and today i just been i'm not been feeling well and if i hadn't promised my nephew that he was going to be here i probably would have slept all day but that is how it is that is how it is sometimes um and just as my nephew was leaving, Christopher got home and we've been uh, watching telly and I've been like, I want to finish my cross stitching and I actually did. So the challenge is done, which is awesome, which means that I can probably do the challenge a couple of times again. Um, I think it is like the 15th of October that the challenge is finish, finishing and it is the 15th of or 14th of july today so that means that i probably can do technically probably could do five pages more but that would be me not doing all the other things i want to do and um right now personally i can't Eight hours stitching every day isn't something that I want to do because I have all my card making and stuff that I really want to do so it's all about kind of imagine managing your day um, I know that I probably will have a couple of hours stitching a day because my body isn't okay I'm, I'm, I'm feeling sick and I'm tired and I'm all sniffly today but I don't know stitching is from when I go up to when I go to bed um, I want to make cards I want to do all these other things so if I can do them I, I will do them instead but yeah hopefully though I will get Mr. Snowman done because he's the next up uh, I don't have a, a like um, a planned rotation that's the word i don't have a rotation per se when it comes to stitching but i do have the um finish a page and then move on sometimes if i get bored of a project i will move on earlier and i can kind of notice myself not taking the stitching in my lap and stuff when i'm sitting down then i know that i'm not into that cross stitch at that moment and then i don't do it and with the snowman I had done I think two columns when I switched to the blue dragon but that was for the challenge but I wanted to show you it because then it's uh, going out of my frame later not probably not today later but yeah here so it wasn't the most fun page to stitch with all of the gray and blue but it worked out pretty good as I said before it was really fun and exciting to um, test the row by row parking, but I think I will do it two columns and two columns parking. And yeah, kitty, kitty cuddles. He's like, I want to be on the camera, mommy. I want to be on the camera. Yeah, he actually just wants to lay and cuddle. And it's so sad. He has so much fur and it's so warm here. So yeah. Look at that. Kitty colours. Um I got some leggings today. Uh 
I've been wanting to have cool leggings so much and I can't really get them in Sweden so I happened to get one of those Facebook commercials someone someone some on my friends list had like like the page and it was like it was 70% off on chosen leggings and they had these space leggings like the, the like galaxy so cool they had them in teal so yes they were so much off and they actually didn't have that much of a shipping the shipping were like eight dollars seven seven eight dollars which is not much at all it all depends on like weight and stuff but in this case i only bought that pair of leggings so i think i bought i think i paid like with taxes and everything around 25 dollars so okay it was okay so hopefully it will um jump into my mailbox in seven to ten days but yeah and hopefully as it said taxes on the little paper thingy it means that i don't have to pay swedish taxes or it won't get stuck in customs something like that we'll see we'll see in seven to ten days it will come here so yeah um yeah uh tomorrow i hopefully have all the energy to make a card otherwise i will just edit one video because tomorrow there's a big blog hop going on that i am going to join and i can tell you because this would probably not be up until a couple of days or something but anyhow um it's been really really fun making a card for it i do want to remake a card for it but uh we'll see we'll see in the morning see in the morning tomorrow i have a day off there is no doctor's appointment there is no um training there is no people coming over it's just me christopher has his last day at work so on the morning at least it's going to be just me which is going to be awesome because i've been longing for that and in a couple of days it's going to be just me for a whole week because christopher is going hiking but yeah right now though i'm heading to bed so good night sleep tight don't let the bed bugs bite